Good day, friends. It is me, HL My Tech, and I've got a brand new Code Blocks lesson. This one is crazy easy and useful. So let's get cracking. So, friends, the first step is to switch to Code Blocks. Second step, create new Code Block. Third step, hit New Design when it pops up. And then we're going to change the name to I because we're making an eyeball. And we're going to put our initials. When you're done with that, click down here so it locks it in place. All right, friends, so what we need to do is create a new object called I. When you bring create new object out, let's rename it and let's put the word I in there and tell it OK. Now let's click on our shapes menu. We're going to create this eye with a sphere, drop it in, make the outside of the eye white. Let's make the radius six. Let's duplicate and make the second one black so it looks like the eyeball. Let's make its radius three. Switch back to move and bring out a move command. And then we want to move it closer to us. So I'm going to put negative three, which I'm really matching this distance right here. And then when we hit play, you'll see we have a eye with part of an eyeball poking out. It's super tiny. Let's change this to negative six. And then you'll see the whole thing poking out. So that's not bad, but it's not perfect. Change your number to say negative four. See if that's how you like it. And what you're making is a happy cartoon eye. The cartoon eye that's included in Tinkercad uh, seems a little angry to me. So I'm trying to make one that looks a little more joyful. So I'm going to try 4.5. And I'm going to find the number that I think I'm going to want to use in all my projects. Friends, right there, you have an eyeball you can use in every project. You can tinker with these numbers to make them a little bit different. But watch this. When you hit export and you export it as a part, it will all of a sudden be included in your Tinkercad parts. I'm going to call it I, and I'm not going to do any tags. I'm not going to lock the part size because I do want to make it different. I'm going to hit save. Super quick, let's go back to normal Tankercad, switch to our 3D designs, and create a brand new design. I'm going to zip to the characters, and I'm going to find Blanky. Here are the angry eyes that I don't really want to put on Blanky. Instead, are you ready for this? Scroll all the way down to where it says you, and find your shape collection, and check it out, friends. There is my brand new eye that I can drag in. Pull up to where I want it. I'm going to use the arrow keys to nudge it back. Control down to lower it down. Now we've got a funny little dude with one eye in the middle of his head, a couple arrow keys, a control D, and move it to the other side. And boom, you can all of a sudden add awesome eyes in an instant to any project you make. Alrighty, friends, so there you have it. Incredibly cool eyes that you can add to any project in an instant and it also shows you just how awesome code blast can be friends if you found the video useful please give it a like if you got a question comment or suggestion add it down below if you haven't subscribed before what are you waiting for smash that subscribe button and last but not least hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me hl mod tech thanks for watching have a great day